Hey guys, Neil Bryan here, and I have found a new game, which is not new, uh, came out in 2013, uh, called Neverwinter, and I have fallen in love with it. I played it over the Thanksgiving holiday, and in the four days I played it, I jumped up into the level 40s, so um, I played it quite a lot, but the double experience also helped me advance quite a bit. I'm now level 49, and I've got a Hunter Ranger, and I wanted to share some of this with you guys, because, uh, as I said, I'm absolutely loving this game. I have not found a game that I love this much in a long time. So, oh look, I do love a lot of games, but this one has been a lot of fun. So, we are in uh, uh, Tarunadar Village, if I pronounce that correctly. I don't think anybody could really cares. Been going through these adventures. Alright, last line of defense, talking to Bulb and Ironbrow. Been, uh, been fighting goblins and freeing miners and basically just helping out being the hero. So the front lines are further up the mountain. These uh, opportunistic goblin runs decided it was a good time for a full out attack on our back lines. Our reserves are holding them off, but we don't have enough soldiers to launch a counteroffensive. Uh, I've been task tasking all the volunteers I can find with mounting an assault on their tribal grounds. I'm worried about the skull cleaver warriors. Some of those are tough goblins. Kill a few for me, would you? Uh, so that is either three Skull Cleaver Goblins. I'll do it. And what's this one? Winter kill goblins have us fighting on the defensive. We need to take the fight to them, but we don't have enough dwarves for a frontal assault. You, on the other hand, might be able to do what an army can't. We need you to infiltrate past the goblin lines, cut your way through their warrants, and kill their chieftain, Murgle Mawcrab. Sounds like a lot of fun. Alright. I got this beautiful horse that I had to pay some real money for. I'm going to follow the magical yellow brick road. And see if we can't go find Mulgrew. That is that what we're doing? Yep, going to the Goblin Warrens. You know, I think I'm going to change my companion because Morpheus here is an excellent meat shield, even though he's not intended to be. He has a tendency to, uh, to jump right into the thick of battle and take a lot of hits, and he doesn't seem to take a lot of damage. In your eye. Yeah, I like the stone as a companion. It helps out with my stats. Uh, but man, there's nothing like a good meat shield when you're doing PvE. In your guts! In your guts! I actually have some hand-to-hand -hand weapons, but I like my bow a lot better, and it seems to be more efficient with that rapid uh, firing that I have. Just a beautiful game. Uh, I love, I've always loved uh, fantasy role-playing games. See? He's a great meat shield. Go Morpheus! And look at the damage. He's like not even damaged. The guys were like killing me a minute ago. Morpheus is like, I'm a mage. I take no damage. In what fantasy role-playing game can you be a mage and not have to worry about dying? But Morpheus is one. Yeah, I'm going to have to fight those guys. See, here's the other way of doing it. I've got this nice little retreat that just leaves Morpheus up in the middle of it all. Oh, but I retreated into another group. <laughs> Always look behind you. All right. All right, 
let's kill these guys. So goblins tend to take you out just by overrunning you. Alright, well, finish that one. Now let's go into the caves and finish this one. Let's finish this one! Ha <laughs> ha! Let's go look for Mulgrew. Kate Mulgrew, whatever his name is. Yes, it is. Not even sure why he follows me. I don't think I pay him for anything. And let's heal up. I like that you can actually like stand on the fire. At least here. There's other fires that allow you on fire, but those little blue circle healing fires? Nope, those just make you feel better. Oh, I missed a little bit. Let's see if we can draw them in. And I do have Morpheus at level 20. I can upgrade him and take him up to 25, but I haven't. I don't have the resources to do that at this point. Alright, um... Let's go ahead and pick up some treasure. Alright, come on Morpheus! Because there always seems to be more. There are a lot of goblins here. I like that how they give kind of a little little girl's cry when they die. That's a lot of treasure. Although I have not been lacking for treasure. And I use healing potions uh, fairly, fairly frequently. Oh, looky, looky! If you don't have the skill to open those, you can buy kits that'll let you open them, which is what I do. I've got the nature skill; it's about the only skill I have. Hey, what you guys hiding down here doing? Uh oh, someone's still shooting at me. Alright, follow the yellow brick road. I said, I love striking them with lightning. All right, took him a while to go down. No, don't see no treasure. On with the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow the yellow brick road. Follow, 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 follow the yellow brick road. La 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 Hey, a treasure box! I'm glad I wasn't a mimic. Mimics suck. They're actually really strong, the living treasure chests. Okay, that's the direction I came from. Just follow the yellow brick road, Neil Bryan. We represent the Lollipop Guild. The Lollipop Guild. The Lollipop Guild. We kill goblins at the Lollipop Guild. But we don't eat goblin lollipops. In your guts. Go Morpheus. Look at all of the booty. Not your booty, Morpheus. Just 
just collect some booty. Woo, woo, glowing place. These little arcane things are nice. They help you to upgrade your equipment, put enchantments on them. I will take you. Okay, I take you into my pouch. Get in my pouch. Oh, that's just money. Alright, did we kill all of the goblins in here? Hello, goblins! Hello! Hello, goblins! Okay, we killed all the goblins there. I'm guessing I'm out here. <gasps> Lightning storm! Now, let's get close enough, they'll stay in it. Alright, Mergle Mawcram. That's who we're looking for. Mergle. Oh, hey, look, I found Mergle Maw Cram. Yay! Is it cram things in his maw? Alright, G. Uh oh. And oh, there's traps in here. Put some plants on the ground under him. Ah, uh, move out of the way. Ah, he froze me. Those little red circles are helpful. They warn you he's coming. But often I'm in the middle of a move. Why is he just running around? Oh, he's bringing in goblins. That's smart of him. Alright, well he is toast! So now we'll just kill his underlings. See, if I had had Morpheus, if I just had that, that, that gem, I probably would just be dead right now. These are traps on the floor, they suck. If you're a trickster class, it's very helpful because they glow red. They actually glow red for uh, others as well, but only a few of them. It's so handy to have a door out right by the guy. I couldn't have just gone in that door to begin with. That would have been nice. I could have avoided a lot of the goblins, but hey! Whatever. Alright. Sounds like they're already fighting. Oh, down I go. Um, here we go. Oh, it's another player fighting him. How handy. Okay, where's the yellow brick road? Seriously, where's my yellow brick road? I don't know which way to go without my yellow brick road. What's in here? Oh, this looks like the fort. Or a different fort. Nope, this is a fort. All right, cool. Return to Balbin Ironbrow. Hey, there's my yellow brick road. Hey, G. Dune. Nasty little brutes, those skill cleavers. Aye. Any luck? That will help slow down their assault to bed. So, you want to help out, do you? I admit. It was a long shot sending you to kill Murgle. You have the Ice Hammer Clan stakes. You're welcome. Oh, level 50. <laughs> level 50 dance. We can handle the goblins here at Tarundar now, thanks to your aid. But we still need your help further up the mountain. Find Garora OQ at the triage camp up on Windchill Reach. She'll be able to tell you what else needs doing. Aye! Okay, so went up a level. Let's uh, look, we got some cool things. Alright, got one power PowerPoint! It's but it's not the same as PowerPoint. It's very different. 
Let's see what I got. I got some new ones. Let's see what went up. Cold Steel Hurricane. Well, that's a lot of damage. Twin Blade Storm. So what is my melee attack and one is for my ranged attack. Let's see, what does this one do? This is a melee. Oh, and that's level 60. All right, let's get this one. And... Oh yeah, I get to increase my stats. Let's see what it'll let me... I was, I've been wondering if I can go above 25 on my decks. That's pretty cool. Um, I always struggle because wisdom is kind of... Well, wisdom and strength are both secondary for my class. I'll go with strength. More strength is always good. I've committed. So 26 dexterity. That's pretty awesome. I have worked to build that up. Um, da -dum -dum. Ranged critical strikes. Okay, more damage on ranged critical strikes. Well, that's interesting. Oh, critical strikes. I like that better. Okay. Boom. And that's it. You're dismissed. Let us mount. Alright. Follow the axe trail. And here I thought it was a yellow brick road. I believe this mount is called a Dusk Unicorn. It's supposed to increase my speed by 110%. I, I'm kind of waffling on whether I whether to get the crab or not. Um, let's see if I can avoid these guys. Because the crab actually went the same speed. Oh, I don't like this. This follow the axe trail mission doesn't seem to work very well for me. Because the yellow brick road thing doesn't light up right. Uh, and I don't know if this is just a mission they took that off. But uh, I've actually wandered around trying to find the axes. Uh, and I followed them a little ways, but I was not able to follow them to their end. We're just killing goblins for the fun of it, why not? Okay. Morpheus, you starting fights with everybody? Thank you. Alright, yeah, and I've already looked at this, so it doesn't tell me anything new. Alright, let's find... Where is the one... That's some other load. Reclamation. Turn in the forward front. Oh, this is the one I need. So let me highlight that so I'll have the proper yellow brick road. I probably should just abandon this axe trail. See, because it starts here, um, goes. Uh, I'm not going to follow it. I, like I said, I followed it about four axes in and have not been able to find it. It's supposed to be a ruby in the ice. And I found some ice too and looked all through it, but I never did find a ruby, so. That is probably a mission I will abandon. Uh, if, you, if you're watching this and you know how to complete this, and it's not actually just the game's messed up with the yellow brick road, uh, comment down below and help me out. As I mentioned, this is not a new game. It came out on PC in 2013, although this year it did only just release on Xbox, which is why we have a kind of a renewed interest in the game. Another thing I'm curious about is, can you cross-platform play? I have not found that in my Google searches. Not that I've spent a lot of time Google searching it. Oh, it's so nice when you just run through the enemies. Hey, that's her. Hello, m'lady! Of course, our giants took our peat from us. But we'll not let them take Tarundar as well. Well, we can use all the help we can get. 
Bobin sent you, did he? Aye! These ice trolls heal so fast that our troops are having serious problems getting them to stay down. I've asked our alchemist, Nalias Gregor, to try to concoct something we can distribute to all the soldiers that'll help with that problem. But he needs blood from the ice trolls to experiment on. It'd be a big help if you could collect some for us. Blood from the ice trolls, sure. Um, this is going to be my last one because, as you can see, it never ends. I mean, it's just one mission after the next. Uh, and it's, yeah. I always think to myself, I'll just finish, because most missions don't take more than five or ten minutes. And I'll think to myself, I'll just do this one mission and then I'll stop. And then they give me another one, and another one, and another one, and it's like, oh good grief. Stop the madness. Okay, I'm just checking to make sure there's nobody else with those uh, diamonds above them, because it's, it's easier to take all the missions at once from a camp. Because most of the time you can go and complete them fairly rapidly, as opposed to trying to do them one at a time. Wait, I'm going back down to the same place I just came up. I gotta collect some vials of blood. The icy chilled wind. Man, they just come out of nowhere. Need to find more trolls. Maybe I should have killed all these guys on the way up, huh? See, look at him. Morpheus is such a great meat shield! Alright, I need more trolls. I still have two more vials of troll blood to collect. Don't run! Hey, I wanna play! I got some for you too. There we go. Following the X. Oh wait, no, I'm not supposed to be following the X trail again. I am just getting ready to abandon that stupid thing. Um. There it is. It keeps defaulting to that thing. Oh, okay, so I'm like... Well, I was in the zone. Let's run back up real quick. Wow, they respawned quickly. There they are. Hello, ice trolls. Me eat you. Rude. Me don't think you eat me. Yeah, me and Morpheus make a pretty good team. Alright, so we got all those. Go ahead and pick up some some more treasure. 
It's kind of nice that it doesn't automatically pick up treasure, being that you can run out of room in your pouch. And I also kind of like you to run out of room in your pouch. That's uh, that's a good, uh, good thing to add into a game. Too many games, you just carry around everything, and it's like, that's that's not even real. Hello, me short, stocky lady. Nalias would be very pleased to have these samples. My thanks. Ah, my welcome. Okay, and as you can see, more adventures. But uh, we are going to stop there. Because it'll never end, which is one of the wonderful things about this game, and one of the horrible things about this game. So, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that. As I said, I've been having a blast with this game, and intend to be playing much, much more. You get to see me advance to level 50, which is pretty cool. And, uh, and I guess that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. You're awesome and incredible, and there is a plan for your life. Don't let anybody tell you differently. And until next time, bye-bye.